Hello YouTubers, what's going on today? Welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars diecast review. Today, we're going to take a look at the Road Trip Lightning McQueen from Cars on the Road on Disney Plus, which was won on the voting poll yesterday on Christmas Day. Before we get now, before I get right into the review, let me discuss something. So, <clears throat> when Lightning McQueen and Mater were planning on going to Mater's older sister we Mato's wedding, they decided to go to the wedding by road by themselves, and Lightning McQueen took on this paint job, which is a un unique and new design for Cars on the Road. And along the way, they stopped at many places such as a truck stop, a st stunt vehicle circus, which Lightning had a fear of clowns, and a dinosaur, a dinosaur park. And so on and so forth, till all the way to Mato's wedding. And after the road trip, I assume Lightning went back into his Rusty's paint job from 2017 in Cars 3. And during his diecast releases, he has been re released in the road trip paint job in sing singles and two packs and uh and multi packs. Now yesterday on Christmas Day I got the road trip McQueen itself along in from the Showtime Story 4 pack with Thailand Mater, who I will be doing doing which which I will which I will customize one of them into the Mater with White Door if it should it be if it should be whether or not if it should be Thailand Mater or China Mater. And the circus stunt biplane and the circus stunt pity. So now without any further ado Let's dig right into the review. So, here we've got his happy facial expression, his white shiny smiling teeth, and his working headlights and bright red paint job. And on the hood, we've got the Radiator Springs on the Road logo saying RS on a Mountain Range, similar to Cadillac Range, and and three words saying on the road, and surrounded by a yellow borderline circle, and on both sides we've got the yellow retro lightning bolt in yellow, orange, and red, red number 95, the gas cap, and the red rims on the black wall light year racing tires, and the gas cap. No name signature or 95 on top. The sp we got the spoiler, which is blank red. And on the back side, we've got the ye a yellow 95 on in between the red actual working taillights and the blank back bumper. And on the undercarriage, we've got two holes, which is... Fittable, I should say, I assume fittable for Mater's tow hook, and Disney slash Pixar made in 
Thailand 2021 Mattel. So let's see if it'll fit Mater's tow hook. So let's start with the China Low, China Mater. Let's see here. Let's see if it'll fit. Yep, it fits the front. It fits the front. Now for the back. It fits the back. And now for Thailand Mater. Nope, not for the front. Let's try the back. Yep, it fits the back. So now, let's compare them to the other McQueens that have a different body mold. We've got regular Cars 1 Lightning McQueen. Here are some similarities and differences. Both are Lightning McQueen, both reside in Radiator Springs, both bear number 95. Cars 1 body mold, Cars 3 body mold, 95 on headlight, no 90, actual headlights, headlight stickers, Rusty's logo on hood, Radiator Springs on the road logo, Lightning Bolt stickers, no Lightning Bolt stickers, 95 and name signature on top. No 95 or name signature on top. Yellow 95. Red 95. Both have the gas cap and the exhaust pipes on the sides. And the red rims on the Blackwall Lightyear Racing Tires. Sponsor logos. No sponsor logos. Rusty's logo on spoiler. No Rusty's decal on spoiler. Rookie stripes. No rookie stripes, indicating that he's no longer a rookie. 95 in between taillights. 95 on taillights, which are stickers. And now for the Cars 2 Lightning McQueen, or should I say... Lightning McQueen with racing wheels. Again, here are some similarities and differences. Both are Lightning McQueen. Both bear the bright red paint job. Ducktail spoiler. Flat spoiler. Both have the working taillights and the bright red paint job. Hudson Hornet Piston Cup logo. Radiator Springs on the Road logo. Ninety-five and name signature on top. No ninety-five and name signature on top. Yellow ninety-five, red ninety-five, yellow lightning bolt mixed with flames. Yellow, orange, and red regular lightning bolt. World Grand Prix. Racing tires, piston cup racing tires, both have the gas cap and the exhaust pipes on the sides. World Grand Prix decals, no World Grand Prix decals on sides. World Grand Prix decals on the back, 95 on the back. Both have the red working taillights. And now for the Regular Cars 3, Lightning McQueen. And as you can see here, both share the same body mold. And the, both have the red, bright red paint job, working headlights, and the shiny white smile. And on the top, and on the hood, Rusty's logo on hood. Radiator Springs on the Road logo, 95 and name signature on top, no 95 for a name signature on top, Lightning Bolt stickers, no Lightning Bolt stickers, both have the red rims on the Blackwall Lightyear racing tires, and the exhaust pipes, and the gas cap on the left side, yellow 95, 
red 95, yellow lightning bolt mixed with flames, yellow, orange, and red retro lightning bolt, piston cup sponsor logos, no piston cup sponsor logos, Rusty's logo on spoiler, no Rusty's logo on spoiler. Both have the red working tail lights on the back. 95 in between. Rusty's logo in between. Sponsor's slogan saying medicated bump ointment 95 on back bumper. Nothing on black back bumper. And that is it. Whew. Now let's compare them to the other McQueens that, that share this body mold. We have Rusty's Lightning McQueen and Rusty's Racing Center Lightning McQueen. And for the other... And that is it. So, what do you guys think? Which Lightning McQueen with the Cars 3 Lightning McQueen body mold is your favorite? And which Cars on the Road diecast should I review next? Should it be the Circus Stunt Biplane or the Circus Stunt Pity? Let me know what you think as well as leaving suggestions in the comments down below and a vote and a vote on the voting poll in the community tab. And if you have enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Also, don't forget to check out some of my other videos on my channel. And I hope to see you guys next time for another review, so please stay tuned. Goodbye now!